Have you ever considered trying the keto diet for 30 days? The ketogenic or keto diet is a low-carb, high-fat diet that's been garnering a lot of attention lately. It's all about shifting your body's metabolism from burning carbs to burning fat, a state known as ketosis. The benefits? Think weight loss, improved cognition, and increased energy. Its popularity is skyrocketing and it's not hard to see why. If you're curious about how to begin, stick with us as we guide you through a 30-day keto diet journey. Before jumping into the keto diet, it's crucial to prepare your body and mind. Now, you might be wondering, why is preparation so important? Well, the keto diet is more than just a meal plan, it's a lifestyle change. So what should you do? Firstly, start by gradually reducing your carb intake. This will help your body get used to burning fat for energy, instead of relying on carbohydrates. It's a significant shift, so take it slow. Next, focus on hydration and salt. You might be surprised to know that staying hydrated and consuming enough salt can help prevent the infamous keto flu. This term refers to the flu-like symptoms some people experience when starting the diet. These symptoms arise due to dehydration and low salt levels, so keep that water bottle and salt shaker handy. Lastly, prepare your mind. Understand that this journey requires commitment and discipline. It's not always going to be easy, but remember, the rewards are worth it. Preparation is the key to success when it comes to the keto diet. Now that you're prepared, let's dive into the 30-day keto diet plan. This journey will be a transformation, not just of your body, but of your understanding of nutrition. Day one through five, it's all about acclimating your body to a new fuel source. Your meals will revolve around lean proteins like chicken or fish, healthy fats from avocados, olive oil, and nuts, and an array of low-carb veggies like spinach, broccoli, and zucchini. It's time to bid farewell to high-carb foods like bread, sugar, and starchy vegetables. From day six to 15, you'll start to feel the effects of your body switching from burning carbs to burning fat. Continue with the protein, healthy fats, and low-carb vegetables, but now you can introduce a wider variety of foods. Think along the lines of eggs, cheese, and even dark chocolate. As you transition into day 16 to 25, you're becoming a fat-burning machine. It's crucial, though, that you maintain balance in your diet. Protein is key to preserving muscle mass while the healthy fats and vegetables provide essential nutrients and fiber. In the final stretch, day 26 to 30, you're not just surviving on a keto diet, you're thriving. You've learned to listen to your body's needs and to nourish it accordingly. This is the time to experiment with keto-friendly versions of your favorite foods. Cauliflower pizza crust, anyone? Remember, this plan isn't about deprivation, it's about balance and choice. There will be challenging days and that's okay. Every journey has its ups and downs, what matters is that you stay committed, knowing that this is a lifestyle change, not just a temporary diet. And don't forget, hydration is key throughout this process. Drink plenty of water and feel free to enjoy beverages like green tea and black coffee. Following this plan will set you on the path to achieving a successful keto diet journey. Remember, a healthier you is not just about losing weight, it's about gaining a better quality of life. Congratulations on completing the 30-day keto diet, but what's next? Now that you've successfully navigated your way through a month of a low-carb lifestyle, you might be wondering where to go from here. The world of post-keto possibilities is vast and varied. Some people choose to continue with the keto diet, finding that it suits their lifestyle and health goals perfectly. They've grown accustomed to the low-carb, high-fat meals and enjoy the benefits of increased energy and improved focus. On the other hand, others may slowly reintroduce carbs back into their diet. It's all about balance and moderation. A gradual reintroduction of carbs can help avoid any sudden shocks to the system, while still maintaining the benefits you've gained over the past month. But most importantly, always remember to listen to your body. Your body knows what it needs, and it's crucial to make decisions based on how you feel. Remember, the goal is to find a sustainable approach to eating that makes you feel your best. So, are you ready to take the Keto Diet Challenge? It's a journey that could transform your life and we're here to guide you through every step. Remember, it's essential to consult with your healthcare provider if you have any health concerns before embarking on this adventure. Your experiences matter, so don't hesitate to share them with us. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more healthy tips and share this video with your friends. Thank you for watching.